Hello, hello, hello everyone, it's your buddy Jay Rassic, and I'm hoping that you're having the best day of your entire life today. And, you know, it. I wish I could say the same, and however, um, as some of you have probably saw in my previous video, apparently there was no audio track to it whatsoever of my commentary, and it was just me just showing a bunch of images with a soundtrack playing in the background, so <laughs> nonetheless, um, a little bit of a bonehead move. It was just a technical nightmare yesterday um, between uh, uh, the recording and then, of course, uh, uh, my hard drive decided to crash on me as well um, because uh, I have a bastard of a cat that likes to push things off my desk and decided to take my uh, hard drive and push it off the desk, which uh, caused it the uh, drives to see. So I have about 15 hours of, um, of the Omaha Zoo that I'm probably not going to be able to show you now. So yeah, so it's just been one of those days. Um, and after reviewing the video, I realized, hey, we should probably actually do some commentary. That would really help. So here we are, take two from yesterday's video. Um, and having to re-record it here. So first off, um, as many of uh, as I was trying to explain in the video is that Planet Zoo has finally showed us some animals um, as well as some building pieces um, that are coming out here in the next week here. So with that being said, let's uh, dig right into it and uh, see if we can find any other building pieces uh, that maybe it's going to be new um, to us as well. So without further ado, first things first is one of our scenery pieces here, which is uh, the um, coach buses here. Uh, and uh, it's funny because in one of my other videos, uh, someone mentioned that Frontier was trying to uh, redo the, the uh, zoo entrances uh, to allow, I guess, some different functionality. So apparently you can use these coach buses for your zoo entrance as well as we can plainly see people coming in and out on the side of the bus uh, kind of weird having it that big of coming out on the side of the bus but hey you know whatever works I guess um, but that also kind of brings me to um, my next uh, theory uh, with the boats that we've been seeing um, and uh, as we can see here's an image of one of the boats right here and uh, sure enough Originally, I thought it was a ride or something like that, but I'm now starting to believe that it is indeed a entrance that you can use throughout your zoo. So that's going to be really cool. Um, so it's going to be, I think the boat is going to be primarily a, uh, um, or the yacht is going to be primarily a uh, entrance um, or a scenery piece that you can put throughout your zoo. So that's going to be kind of cool on that avenue there. Um, oh, that's not what I wanted there. But uh, yeah, anyway, so um, I believe that this indeed is going to be the case. Um, also in this picture, I noticed a couple other things that uh, um, that we don't currently have in game, like these little flags along here. I did not notice those before, but those are indeed pro uh, new, have to be a new scenery piece. The other thing is this, uh, this uh, archway. I think we have a archway in the classic pack, but... Um, or the classic zoo deluxe whatever it was um, but i don't think we it has this gold trim on there but so i'm pretty sure this is all new right here as well um the trees themselves look a little bit newer too um they could be the white birch but for some odd reason the bark on there looks a little bit different and then of course we as we mentioned in a previous video we have the the pathing here is a whole new pattern and someone did actually confirm that that is a new pathing and it's uh, not currently in game. Uh, the other thing I noticed was uh, this piece right here at the top and um, these archways with pillars and so forth. I think that's going to be a newer um, building pieces that we're going to be seeing here as well. Um, next up uh, we will have uh, our uh, fire salamander which uh, I think is going to be a really cool addition. Uh, here they said, perched by a mossy tree trunk, uh, was a creature Lumi has never seen before. With a dark, slender body, large, expressive eyes, according to legend, fire salamanders were born in fire. They were likely hiding in firewood and escaped in the embers. But it's a good story. So I cannot say how old I love this thing. 
And what's really nice about this is that it's not a frog. <laughs> that's all I gotta say. The other thing that's really nice um, uh, is that it closely resembles a North American fire sa uh, tiger salamander. Um, I, so, uh, and not so much the barred tiger salamander or the eastern, uh, but it, it does represent a lot of the eastern. So as you can see here, the woman spotted here and everything to our right, um, I think that is, whoops, uh, is gonna be a lot like what, um, basically looks a lot like that fire salamander. So I think that's gonna be kind of cool because then we can kind of maybe use, uh, it in the uh, North American exhibits and so forth and implied as a tiger salamander just you know change the board um, the uh, info board and whatnot and everything will be fine the uh, UI guests are not gonna know the difference so um, but yeah I really love the the, uh, um, the just the look the overall look of this um, I'm really hoping that they actually have it as swimming um, animations just like they did the terrapin and a couple and the uh, American bullfrog so I'm really crossing my fingers for that um, other thing is that we got here is our gondo uh, uh, gondolas uh, so to add a little Venetian flair to your zoo with our new gondolas gondolas are one of the new scenery items coming in the planet zoo they're sure to make the zoo look bellissimo uh, that's definitely Italian if I didn't think so myself. I'm, uh, but again, uh, several things I noticed in here right off the bat is um, I, I want to say these pillars right here or this uh, trim work is going to be new. The flags um, and it uh, looks like a new roofing piece possibly. Um, kind of a orangish shingles. Um, and then of course uh, the moments right here uh, or the boat ties um, and buoys. Uh, that we'll be getting over there. Um, I also want to say that this wood trim right here, this does not, I mean, it closely resembles the Arctic uh, wood trim uh, fencing, but I think, I don't think so. I think that's that's new right there. So, um, so yeah, so there's quite a few different things going on in this picture alone uh, for new pieces that are going to be in game. Um, and then finally, um, as of uh, December 8th, I believe it is, yeah, December 8th, uh, they show off the links. And again, we have those nice pillar trims and everything like that that I swear will be um, new in the game. Like, I do not believe we've had this piece before. That might be an Indo uh, Indian window of some sort. But I think that pretty much this is all new stuff here so um that's basically all there is to show just yet so i guess we're gonna have to see wait to see what's gonna be tomorrow um uh what or actually that would be today december 10th um and i have to see exactly what frontier is gonna provide for us next so um with that all being said um i think uh out of all this so far i'm really excited for the bus or the coach um, and I mean obviously they are definitely uh, uh, flexi color as you can see there they're two different colors and so forth um, but yeah so I'm really excited to, to have this in game and I'm pretty darn sure um, the next few pieces that will be announced if they do announce will of course uh, be the uh, the boat um, there we go the boat there and I also want to be shocked uh, if, if we uh, maybe hear something about the food truck here soon so <laughs> um, so there you have it folks um, feel free to uh, you know like the video if you haven't already and if you're a first-time subscriber or viewer make sure you subscribe for upcoming content that I put out on a weekly basis so Without further ado, uh, let me know in the comments down below what you're excited out of all these pictures here, or, or your speculations of what's going to be in the uh, in the uh, new DLC pack. And until next time, build, play, and enjoy. This is Jay Rassic signing out. Hey everyone, thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, make sure you smash that like button and put a comment down below. If you're new to the channel, please subscribe to my weekly release content. 
You can follow me on Steam, Discord, Twitch, Twitter, and now even Facebook. Until next time, build, play, and enjoy.